Today I'm just going to look at how to make a playlist using YouTube videos. Helpful if uh, you want to load up a bunch of videos to have them playing one after the other. If the likes of uh, the way I'm doing this is to entertain my children without having to sit and look through a bunch of videos that they may want. Okay, first off, you need to log into YouTube.com <coughs> and log into your account. If you've not created an account, create one and log in. Uh, the easiest way to do the videos is to first do a search. I'm going to have a look for Rihanna and Umbrella. It's my little girl's quite like a song. So there we go, as a link here. Right, when you look at the video, you're looking for the ability to embed it. If this uh, section says copyright information, etc., you can't embed it, embed it into your playlists. Uh, so therefore look for another version. Okay, you see this box here, this little link, add to playlists, pops up this box. I'm going to add a new playlist. Clicking OK. Brings us to a screen where you fill in the information on your playlist. Uh, this one I'm going to call Girls Vids. Add description, music, videos, or my girls. Tags to help people search uh, and pop up on people's searches, etc. Just gonna put music videos and pop. I'm gonna make this public and I'm going to allow embedding because uh, after this initial tutorial, I'm going to show you how to um, basically play your playlist from your desktop. So I'm going to save playlist info. So it brings us back to our video again. And success message, video added. Next one I'm going to look for is uh, Lily Allen, Mark Ronson, remix of Oh My God. Right, so I've got a link here. Again, first thing I'm going to check is if I can embed this. You can see here, embedding disabled by request, probably for copyright reasons. So coming back, try and check for another version and this one allows embedding so I can add this to the playlist so again adding to playlist selecting get those vids from it and pressing OK now when I look at the add to playlist box you can see there's two videos in get those vids ok and now we're going to look for another song we'll say Skater Boy by Avril Lavigne look at those like this Again, clicking a link. You can see here this one allows embedding. So I can add to playlist, selecting girls' vids again, and OK. You can now see there's three videos in it. Uh, keep on doing this, adding videos until you have uh, your full selection. Now to uh, create um, your playlist uh, for your desktop, etc., you go into your My Accounts, or indeed just to play your playlist. My accounts then playlists under video. Again, all your playlists are going to be down this side. Again, you can create another playlist if you like. Um, you can edit, delete, a uh, bunch of other options here. The one I'm going to go for is create a custom player to play these three little videos directly from my desktop. So click and create custom player. Player name is going to be Girls Vids again. And selection of music, music even, fits for my girls. Right, you have a preview pane across here, I'm seeing what the, let's drag this across, how the video is going to look, uh, the player, I mean, there you go. So I'm going to choose a nice pink background, see it's the girls. I'm going to select this layout here, so you can select the videos from the right hand side. Um, just need to confirm your content. So the content is from playlists, girls' vids. So I'm just going to select to confirm that. And now I'm going to generate code for the video, which I'm going to use to play it from a desktop. 
So if I come down now, you can see the code is now generated in this box here. Right, let's get a minimize the minute. Right, what you're going to need now is a text document. <coughs> so you create a new one on your desktop, right click, select new, and text document. So I'll just have to bring that up a bit so you can see it in the video. New text document. Good, okay. Um, you see I've already created one called playlist template.txt. And you can rename it to whatever you like. Now I'm using this one just a basic template so I can um, use it to uh, you know, embed different videos in. This document, when it's opened up, so I'll just get rid of this. This is a previous one I was experimenting on. It's a basic HTML document containing commands to do a basic web page. Um, all these tags here are necessary for the page. It starts off with uh, an HTML tag. All tags are enclosed uh, with a left and right arrow. A finishing tag is the same command again, apart from it's got a forward slash on it. Okay, okay, so the document starts with HTML, finishes with forward slash HTML. Within it is head commands. Again, you've got your arrows and head and a forward slash head command at the end. And most internal commands are body. Again, body with arrows and a forward slash before it there. Okay, dokie. So just pop this back up again. I'm going to right click and copy the embedded code. I'm going to right click and paste it within this document. I'm now going to file, save as, and I'm going to call this girls playlist dot text. I'm saving it to my desktop. Okay, okay. Shutting that down. Now I have girls playlist dot text. I'm going to right click and rename it. I'm just going to take the last three letters out, the dot text, and replace it with dot html. Okay, okay. Uh, warning coming up, if you change your file name extension, the file may become unusable. You sure want to change it? In this occasion we do, so I'm clicking yes. As you can see now, it's uh, associated with Firefox. So if I double click this, it opens up the music player with my three videos selected. Uh, and again, choose and play. I'll now play these videos one after another. Or indeed, I can select them individually from the right hand pane. Alright, that concludes the little tutorial how to make a YouTube playlist. Hope it's been of some use to you and uh, you can understand the Scottish accent with the ums and airs thrown in in between. Cheers now, sign out, the bam. <laughs> <laughs>